Welcome back guys to the channel. My name is Mark. Is you watching the Chance Vlogs? Let's get today started. So we're starting it off in the SI tonight or today, this morning. Um, got a few things to do to the SI. Not so many things, but like three things to do to it. First off is, you see how dirty it is down there? We're going to get to vacuuming this car up. After that, we're going to show you guys a couple of things that I didn't like about the car. It's probably like two things that I didn't like about the car. That's what we're going to be removing. And I'll show you guys that in a little bit. But for right now, let's get to vacuuming this car up. And then we'll move on to the next thing. And uh, I did buy floor mats for this thing. That's why I'm vacuuming the car. I'm going to vacuum it all up. Get the, the floor mats. And I always do all my floor mats from eBay just because um, I don't want to deal with um, like buying $200 floor mats for a car like that I'm on a daily drive. You get me? And like out here, especially in Huron, it gets really, really dusty, really, really... um dirty like there's a lot of like agriculture going on so there's a lot of like the uh, debris on the floor a lot of stuff on the floor like that can get into the vehicles like leaves and like this and like that so like so much stuff that can get in here so regardless of that let's get to vacuuming the car up this is my favorite thing ever so like to get into the garage we could now do this yes All right, so we're in the garage now, and uh, to get into the garage, we we, don't, we just need a key now, so it's so dope. I'm, I'm excited over that. I never had that in my life before, and um, it's just easy access for me. I come bring the car in at night. It's like 2, 3, and 4 in the morning, and my grandma doesn't even have to wake up. So I've got the package right here. I'm going to open this for you guys real quick, so let me set this down right there. So these are the floor mats here. Damn, this is weird. That is weird. I want the black just because I couldn't find um, red ones for this part. So here we are. There's nothing else in the red. Toss that away. Open these bad boys up. Come on, relax, relax, relax. So check it out. I went with these. They have an SI uh, stitching right here. And these are just some bootleg ones from eBay, like I told you guys. Um, I don't, or I don't even know if I mentioned to you guys, but these are bootleg from uh, eBay. I really don't like care for buying expensive ass floor mats. These are just like so they could look nice, so you could cover the floor, all the floor, and these are like almost an exact fit. So um, that's what I dig about them. So this is gonna be the passenger side. Let's go throw this in, and then we'll, well, I'll just throw the rest in on my own time, and I'll show you guys what it looks like after. So let's go throw this one in first. I'm trying to do this all with one hand, guys. So bear with me. Uh, come on. Okay. I'm gonna set you guys down real quick. I'm gonna set this in. And you guys will see, like, this is like a perfect fit right here. So check it out. Watch. So check that out. That's a perfect fit, like, exact fit almost. Like, right here, if, like, le falta poquito, that means that, like, it needs a little bit, like, a little bit cut off right there and then trimmed out this way. But, um, for the most part, it fits almost like snug. It fits snug. Let's just say that. Let me see if I can move it this way a little bit more. So I'm going to get to putting the rest of them in. That looks pretty damn good, huh, with the SI logo right there. Gives a little red accent to the car. So I'm going to put the rest in, show you guys what it looks like after. Check out the driver's side now. And this one fit really, really snug. I think this one fit better than the other side. And then um, it has these little uh, hangers right here on both sides. So that way um, the carpet doesn't go anywhere. And then the other carpet that I had was touching this uh, floor pedal or the gas pedal. And I didn't like that, but um, now it fits snug, nice and neat. And it uh, gives a little accent to the uh, red stitching on the um, seats and and the door panel, the little um, armrest there. But um, that's it for the interior, guys. It looks much, much cleaner. I'm digging it. Comment down below if you guys think that $30 was worth it. I think so. But next thing we're going to do to the car is going to be um, this spoiler, right? Or this, um, like, visor, I guess you could say. So, um, I think this is on with tape. I'm pretty sure it is. So, we're going to pull this off because I think it's so ugly. I, I think it just, like, gives an ugly appearance to the car. Look at that. Like, I just don't like it. So, we're going to get to pulling that off real quick. Try to get this done. So, I'm going to set this. Okay, we're gonna hold that right there with one hand. And we're gonna unscrew with the other one. Okay. 
All right, there's one. Okay. Next one is out. Throw that right there. Right here. That's two. And then let's go to the other side. We'll finish this up and I'll show you guys what it looks like after. All right, guys. So we pretty much finished up here. Look how much better it looks without the thing. Um, sunroof is all the way in. It looks much better without the... Uh, that was actually OEM Honda. So um, if any of the subscribers that have this type of car want it, I didn't like it personally for my car. If you guys want it, hit me up. I will email or email me. I'll put the link in the description to my email. Um, hit me up there. Let me know that you want it. If you pay for the shipping, I will ship it to you. So um, let me know and someone could have that. So yeah. Next, um, let's go over the car. So you guys did see the floor mats. Floor mats look clean. I already stepped in there, but it looks way cleaner than it did before. Looks nice. Um, car seats are back in right now. Look at that solid. Um, back here looks way better, way cleaner. Um, these are going to get thrown in the trash right now. All right, guys, so a couple of days have passed. I just want to leave off exactly who we were at before, but um, we're back at my grandma's pad right now. Um, a few days have passed, like I said, probably two or three days. I want to say two maybe, but um, we're back, and uh, we're going to get to clean up all this mess that we have here. Well, we did finish the SI. Uh, we got that visor taken off, so it looks way better. It's just a lot dirty, but um, I got to clean that all up. But I feel like it looks a lot cleaner. And like I said, if anyone wants that visor, you guys can hit me up in the email down below. And um, you guys pay for shipping costs, I'll ship it to you guys. <clears throat> for the hatch, we did get um, a package in that same day. UPS came, they dropped off the package. And um, we got new uh, regulators with motors for the uh, hatch because windows were going up a lot slow. So um, I didn't want that happening no more. I already installed the driver's side. Let me show you guys how fast this thing goes up now. So. Damn, my tire's low over there. Okay, so let me hop in here. It's so cold in here. All right, so let's turn this bad boy on. Okay, so check this out. It's cold. So I'm gonna show you guys the passenger side right now, how slow this goes down. Check it out. Well, it goes down slow, kind of slow, but it goes up even slower. So check that that out. Maybe how slow that goes up. A few inches later. Okay, that took like an eternity, guys. That took like a gold like two minutes right there. But let me show you guys the driver's side now. So look how much smoother it goes down, and then it comes up. Perfect, so um, makes no noise. It's really, really subtle. This one is a lot louder. So I'm gonna get the new motor and regulator installed in that one. Um, very, very simple to install. I already did it one time. So like, I just have to learn one time real quick, do it one time, then I'll, I'll have it down forever. But um, that's what's going on with the hatch right now. We're doing that to the hatch. It's so cold in here. I drive home from work and it's cold. I can't, I, I can wait until fucking winter comes because it's dumb cold in here, guys. Um. I don't know if I mentioned to you guys, my gauge, exactly where you see it now, that is cold temperature right now. That's I just started up the car. That's a cold start right there. That's my temperature when um, I'm driving home from work in winter because um, I have a dual core radiator and that thing keeps this car so cool that I have no heater in here. So um, I gotta wear Hala sweaters, it's dumb cold. I'm gonna have to switch off to the um, stock radiator, that way we got a heater again.
All right, so I just finished tightening up everything on this side. Um, let me show you guys how fast, how much faster it goes down. Put that out. Maybe how slow that goes up. Up. Uh, it's working a lot better than it was before, and I'm happy with it. I'm 50 bucks in on the motors and whatever, like 100 bucks for both. I'm down with that, it's not a lot. So um, I spent $200 for the full conversion, which is not horrible. Um, I wanted new ones just because they go up and down faster. I didn't want to be dealing with the headache of those going out later anyway, so um, we just did this real fast. Sauce, guys, there it is. All the paneling is back in both sides. We're good. Windows are rolling up and down really, really good now. The other side, I need to put a little, uh, the passenger side, I gotta put a little bit more uh, grease on the uh, window rails or whatever they're called, the little regulators, and it should be going up and down a little bit better. I'm also gonna check the voltage on that and see if um, the voltage is right because um, it, it seems like it's lacking power on the other side, but we'll check that out. A little bit of the same thing for the hatch. I had to do that. I couldn't stand that. Those windows went up and down really, really slow. So um, I had to fix those up. I had to clean up the garage. DSI is done. Let's let's wrap it up. I'll catch you guys in the next video. I think thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Peace.